Okay, it is a fine day in the end times. It is, I think, Thursday afternoon, March 10th, 2022. So, uh, I just did something I've never done before. I just bought an acre of land that I have never set foot on. I have never set foot on this property since the day I was born. And, uh... <laughs> And it's right next door to the one I just bought. So, uh, let's head out into the big jungle. Alright. Good lord. Looks like some fine piece of jungle. What do you think, little dog? All right. Well, I'm going to have my work cut out for me. you got to make your own way through the jungle. You need to go get darmadillas like that. Okay, we've got... We've got oak trees. We've got palm trees. Very nice trees on this proper tie. All right. And so this is the. You need to get an armadillo like that. You know, there's an armadillo around here like that. This is armadillo territory. So this is the place we just bought. And now. We have bought this side. Good lord. So, <laughs> I've lost my damn mind. I really have lost my damn mind. But, uh, get out there and get your money working for you. tree there. Uh, uh, the oak and palm. Glad to say I do not see one single pine tree on this property. Not a pine tree be found. Okay, now is ah, a pine tree. We do have a big ass pine tree. I guess I will. I I'll, I'll let one pine tree per acre. Oh no, that's a pine tree too. I got two big ass pine trees. So uh, that thing is a pine tree. This thing is the most massive pine tree. <laughs> Three big ass pine trees. This must be the pine forest back here. Good Lord. Okay, for a pine tree, I will say that is a gorgeous pine tree. It's built more like an oak. I have never seen a pine tree with branches like this. My God, that's the biggest pine tree I've ever seen in my life. Anyway. Crazy day. It has been. A crazy day, and uh, not one square inch of any of this is on the floodplain. So instead of uh, waterfront, all right, we got a. I'm hoping this is at least an oak tree. Yeah. Sancho, don't you be gone next door. All right. 
so uh, instead of fronting the water, it looks out over this 200 acre ranch back here. All right. So, more pine trees. Guess I'll have to get over my prejudice against pine trees. <sighs> Sancho! Fine looking sunset view. Little dog, what are you doing? Sancho? Come on now. Alright, so this lot actually has a much prettier sunset view than the than the other one. Ah. Good Lord, am I going to have my work cut out for me. Uh, what are you doing, the dog? Alright, some more of these curly leaf yuccas. These are uh, actually, I'm pretty sure these are a native. She so had these in Austin, the curly leafy yucca plant. That is a beauty there. Sancho does not like walking through the stickers like that. What are you doing, little dog? Come on. All right. <laughs> Still a landowner in the oasis of freedom. Good Lord. Sancho, what are you doing? He is not coming through here. Oh, if I were a younger man. Too damn many. Too many irons in the fire. This is what I was clearing out last week. And that beautiful oak tree there. I'm opening up and that big old oak tree through here. Sancho, are you just going to sit there or what? Sit. <sighs> that cedar tree has to come out. Yes, I get to play God here. Next fall, I'll get to come down here next fall and play God. Figure which one of these trees lives and which one dies. <sighs> pine trees. Mm. Little dog, what are you doing? Are you just sitting there or what? Because I'm not walking through the stickers. And that nice big old oak tree. Pretty gorgeous. Sign coming through the. Come on, little dog, you can come through here. There's no stickers back here. Come on now. Sancho. Come on. You can get through there. <laughs> come on, little dog. Sancho, come on, <laughs> this little dog, he steps on a damn sticker bush, 
and it is all over. Uh, that'll be a beautiful oak tree at some point. <laughs> Come on, little dog. I don't know about the sticker plants like that. Don't know if I like the stickers like that. Hmm. Well, that's almost as pretty as what I'm leaving behind. Come back and get the picture of the sunset. Alright. So if you wanted to open up sunset. Alright, I get it. Take out that tray. I'm sitting here. Figuring out planet eating. This is the uh, oldest game in the human playbook. <laughs> Figuring out how to play God. Oh, man. Ferns here. I wasn't expecting to see. All right, Sancho, you're out of the stickers now. Go get your armadillo like that. Good Lord. Well, I ever learned the difference between wrens and cardinals. I'm gonna have to water my mark my territory. I love marking my territory. There you go. I'll just think I will be happy with this purchase. <sighs> Man, we're in a regular little palm oasis here. But I want to open up that oak tree. And God, how many palm trees are right here. Somebody's already been doing some clearing on the palmettas. Mm. I'm assuming that fence is accurate. Uh, we've just bought a regular little uh, palm oasis back here. All right. It's amazing when you double the size of your property. <sighs> I'm 
wish I had a chair and a margarita. I figure, let's go watch the sunset. Up here we got a big ass cedar tree. I have a so I have a big old cedar tree and both these parcels. I'll leave this one up. I see they cut the power lines right through it. That's cool that they didn't cut the whole tree down. All right. And a paved road. Imagine that. A paved road and one block from here is 55,000 acre state forest. You can go for miles and miles. That 55,000 acre state forest. See a bunch of squirrely nests in there. There are squirrelies. We got squirrelies and we got armadillos like that. Land ownership. What a weird concept. The concept of land ownership. Once you can just come in and just buy a piece of the planet. This is what I cut out last week, the driveway heading in. Mmm. All right. I just didn't have enough on my plate. Did not have enough on my plate. So I had to go add some more. We oh, got this. Two nice new homes right across the street. So this is where I will be living for sale. All right. This will be my spot in my little camper next year. All right. Call it. A night. I was going to wait for that sunset, but getting on home, I'm ready for a margarita. No, you don't need to be going through there. Oh my gosh.